Hey, it's me, Riv. I'm back. I know I was away for a while, but you know what? When you hit it big like I did, you know, and you have a massive following, you just need some time off. The pressure gets to you, and you need about five months off. But anyways, Weezer has brought to my attention a new album, accompanied by its opening track, Just Dropped Today. And so let's talk about it. First off, this seems like a very blatant promotional stunt, along with Green Day and Fall Out Boy, to announce their tour, the, uh, what's it called, the Hella Mega Tour, which, um, you know, you won't see me there, but I'm sure someone's excited for that. But anyways, here is the album cover in all its glory. Um, I'm not too keen on it. I think it's a bit cheesy. I understand what they're going for with the 80s aesthetic with the lightning bolts and the ring wear, but that doesn't mean I like it. Also worth noting is the equally silly title, Van Weezer. Um, but I, I guess it's aptly titled as it seems that they're trying to capture the essence of Van Halen, which is very clear and obvious by the opening track here, so let's just talk about that. So right off the bat, the end of the game opens very promisingly with these soaring guitar arpeggios and Rivers Cuomo sort of coming in with these nice vocal ad-libs, and it all just comes together very nicely. And it sounds a lot like Van Halen. I mean, those guitar arpeggios, once we get into the main guitar riffs here, they're much crisper, much cleaner than what you would get from Weezer. And it just sounds like almost take for take um, your, your run-of-the-mill Van Halen song, which worried me because as great as it sounds, I don't want a Van Halen album. I can... This is 2019. I can look, go on my phone and listen to any Van Halen album I want. I don't need that from Weezer. It seems like that them doing this to begin with is sort of just them writing off the Kurt Tales of the Teal album, as that was a nice little hit for them. But that concern that uh, Weezer would be copying Van Halen beat for beat sort of gets alleviated by the verses and choruses on here, as those are very much more in line with what Weezer would do, especially early Weezer. Like, uh, I'm thinking more Maladroit for this sort of sound, and that, that is really refreshing given what Weezer has been putting out more recently. But something that hasn't really changed is the sort of run-of-the-mill quality of the lyrics Rivers Cuomo's been putting out on songs recently. What we have here is a very basic falling out of love type of situation where you're reminiscing on, on all the great times you've had, but now you're at the end of the game, hence the title. I like the little callback to Island in the Sun in there, but overall, it's... um. The lyrics can go over your head and you won't miss anything, really. But outside of the lyrics, Rivers Cuomo offers up some, some really sticky melodies on here, especially on that chorus, and they're all well-delivered. And there's really nothing to complain about there at all. It's, it's a fun listen, to, to say the least. Everything is well-layered with uh, little guitar fills here and there. It, it's all been put together very nicely, and I think it's a well-composed song. Overall, I think it's, uh, it shows... Mild promise for what's to come with this album. I think it shows that Weezer's able to take very clearly from <laughs> an influence and work it into their own style. It didn't feel like they were just straight up copying Van Halen. I was very afraid I'd be listening to something that might as well be a Van Halen B-side, but that was not the case, and hopefully that's a trend that continues throughout the entire album, but we'll have to wait and see. Uh, for now, however, I'm feeling a 7 out of 10 on this song. And as always, your opinion is openly invited in the comments below. You know, this was a very quick, light review, so if you have any more insights, I would love to hear them. And uh, if you have any suggestions for what I should review in the future, I am open to those, of course. And otherwise, um, you know, subscribe, maybe. And um, that about does it.